Hey guys, what is going on? It is Deboki here once again. It is time for a cooking with Deboki. I am here home for lunch from the work day and uh, I'm gonna go ahead and whip myself up something really quick to eat. I don't really have that much time, so I like to cook something that's a little bit fast, yet nutritious. Yeah, a little bit exotic. So you guys might be wondering what's on the menu for this lovely day today, and well, actually not too much. We're gonna have some sweet ray barbecue sauce, salad, chicken patty, and some of this glorious rice, or we like to call it bop in the Korean language. I usually come home for lunch so that I can play with Yuki and let her out and of course cook up some food because eating at home is a lot cheaper than eating out, as we all probably know that. Plop this chicken right in there. Oh, babies. So uh, I bought like a pack of four or seven chicken breasts just so that I can have them all seasoned. I froze them in the freezer so that when I come home for lunch, all I gotta do is just toss them in and uh, I can make chicken salad, I can make chicken noodles, chicken rice. I'm having a lot of chicken. You guys are probably wondering like, why the chicken devotes? Good source of protein and it's cheap. One plus one equals bueno. I'm gonna go ahead and heat up the rice. Gotta get myself a bowl first of all. Do I want a bowl or do I want a plate? I think I'm not gonna go for like a bowl plate. These are called bowl plates. Leave me alone, I need to eat food. Pack my bowl with the rice cakes. Let me heat that up here. I really don't know how long I'm supposed to put things in the microwave for. I just uh, throw it in there and pray that it will be heated when I take it out. Yeah. Chicken is looking nice and we're gonna go and flip this bad boy. A nice little white layer of whiteness there. I'm not sure what that means, but it probably hopefully means good things. Got it prepped already so that you don't even have to do any prepping when you come home. For you guys that are in like a full-time job position or even at school, you guys know that prepping food is always the most time-consuming part. You want to get that done like the night before or even the morning of, and you don't want to ever do it when you come home because you're not going to have time. Because you're going to decide to film a video while you're doing this, and you're going to be like, Oh, I don't have time to film and prep food. We're just gonna have a nice little vinaigrette sauce on there for our dressing, I think. Nothing too fancy dancy. Yuki, say hi. Chicken. So I guess the rule is with chicken, you don't want to have it undercooked at all. Um, I do actually like my steaks a little bit bloody, but uh, for chicken, you want to cook those things all the way through. Oh, look at that side. That one was a good one. That one was a good one, too. I'm liking these. This color is good. What do you think, Yukarino? Is that color good? It's good. What is the recipe of this? I'm not sure. Maybe Deboki style rice chicken because it's just pretty much chicken on rice. You can omit the rice. I'm just eating it because I'm Asian and I love rice and it's just delicious with everything. I'm going to go ahead and toss some of this chiz on my salad. <sighs> this is like poor, fast lunch life. This is not a fancy meal at all, ladies and gentlemen. You can just eat this whenever you feel like it. This is not something you make for a date. This is like something you make for your sad, lonely self <laughs> coming home from work or school. So I think chicken is pretty much done. Um, it's been cooking for a very long time, I think. I never really know how long to cook chicken for. I just cook it till it stops squawking. Also, I do apologize about the lighting. Like, I move it over here and it gets really dark, and then I move it over here and it gets somewhat light. It's off my phone. So, video quality might be like a potato. Oh, I really want to eat a potato now. This is actually a lot of food. I didn't realize how much I was cooking. Look at all that. That's a little too much, I think. This is, um, chicken. I'm using the whole thing. And rice. This is probably, like, the most unappetizing thing I cooked for you guys so far. I'm gonna just pop some barbecue sauce on top. Hopefully in a... I was gonna say a very exotic way, but I just splattered it all over myself. I like to draw a little sign. That's like a question mark. Or I like to think of that as a dolphin. As you can see, there's a fin, and that's the head. I'm also going to garnish the top with some green onion. Oh, you're outdoing yourself right now. Now the dolphin is engulfed in seaweed. Speaking of seaweed, I'll be enjoying this lovely meal with a side of ghee, which is, um, for Korean, this is actually seaweed. And it's really delicious. It's what you wrap sushi with and stuff. But uh, they come in these little packs. Look at this guy's face. But he is just loving it right now. He's just saying, hey, my mustache is rocking. And this game is even more rocking. Anyways, this is my meal. We got some chicken with barbecue and some garnish. This is a dolphin design, so it's only uh, exclusive to Deboki's home. We got the rice underneath just to give it some more umph, and we got some lettuce for our salad. Anyways, ladies and gentlemen, I'm gonna go ahead and dive into it because I'm super hungry and I don't have a lot of time because I gotta go back to work. I gotta eat, play with the youksters, and run back to work. This has been Deboki. Thank you so much for watching this little cooking with Deboki. Nice.